Zcash is a very popular cryptocurrency with some nice privacy features, but how do you mine Zcash on your Mac? That's what I'm going to show you in today's episode. Mining Zcash on your Apple Mac, whether it be an iMac, a MacBook, MacBook Pro, MacBook Air, even a Mac Mini is really simple to do. You don't need any coding skills or anything like that. I'm going to show you exactly how to do it. We'll be using a free and easy to use program called Minergate, which you can see on the screen right now. I will leave links to Minergate in the description down below if you'd like to give it a download and try it yourself. This program is really great. It's free and it's really easy to start mining. So go ahead and click the download and start mining button, install the program, and then you can start mining for Zcash. Now I'll just give you a quick look through Minergate here. We can see our wallet, which is where all of our coins are stored. We can see the smart miner. So this is a special feature where if you click it, they will analyze what's going to be the most profitable coin for you to mine and it will specifically mine that coin. The miner section is where you can go through each of the coins, and this is gonna be important if we wanna mine Zcash. And then there's also benchmark where you can see how good your computer is. But we wanna mine Zcash, so let's go to the miner section. You can click show all to see all the coins that you can mine, but I'm gonna hide a bunch of them so we can more easily get to our Zcash mining. So here we are, Zcash mining, go ahead and click start mining to mine. Now you can see CPU mining and GPU mining. I don't have a GPU in this computer, unfortunately, so I can't mine with a GPU, but I've got four CPU cores. And so I can mine with just one core, or I can mine with two cores, or I can mine all the way up to four cores. My MacBook Pro has eight cores, so I can mine with up to eight cores. Now it's up to you how many cores you use. Some people have reported that if they use all of the cores of their computer, their computer becomes extremely slow and sluggish. However, I haven't found that to be the case with either of my Macs. I can mine using the maximum number of cores and I can still do basic things like web browsing, watching YouTube, all of that sort of stuff. More data intensive, more heavy things, I need to lower that down or pause it completely. But generally, it's fine for me to run it at four cores. Now, as we're talking about this, I do also recommend that you download a program called SMC Fan Control. I'll leave the links to that in the description below, but that allows you to monitor the temperature of your computer and to increase the internal fan of your computer. So mining for Zcash and mining for these other cryptocurrencies makes your computer really hot. So being able to control that fan and increase the fan speed to bring your temperatures down are going to be very important. So as you can see, um, my computer's going away mining Zcash. Because I'm recording this episode, it's not doing very well. Generally, this will get up to about eight to 10 solutions per second. And we can see that I've already got some unconfirmed balance here. If I just go ahead and keep mining, then that will move into my currency balance. And I can then go ahead and take that money out and send it to my own Zcash wallet, which is what I would definitely recommend you do. So there you have it. That's how you mine Zcash on your Mac. Really simple and easy to do, completely free. Minergate is free, and I'll leave the links to that in the description down below. And SMC Fan Control, that's free as well. So it's free to start mining. Obviously, you need to pay for your own electricity as well. So when it comes to profitability, is it profitable to mine Zcash or other cryptocurrencies on your Mac? Chances are it's not going to be profitable. You'd be better off rather than paying for the electricity to pay for the coin itself just on an exchange or something like that. But if you wanna give it a go and you wanna get into it and give it a try like I do, then this is a great way to do it. I also did an episode on what's the most profitable coin to mine on your Mac. So go ahead and check out that episode find out what's the most profitable for your computer, and then I would recommend mining that coin maybe over Zcash. Or check out this episode that I did on cloud mining and how you can mine by hiring other people's computers to mine for you. Thanks so much for watching. If you found this helpful, please give this video a like and subscribe to the channel for future crypto tutorials. Until next time, best of luck out there.